Hi guys, my name is Rick Miller. I'm the senior technical support lead here at Line 6 and today I'm going to take you through the process of registering and activating your brand new Pod Studio UX2 device. So, what I've done so far is I've taken the UX2 out of the box. I've plugged the USB cable into the computer. Uh, the other end is obviously plugged into the device. And I've installed PodFarm from the disk. Um, when you install PodFarm, you're also going to get a version of Line 6 Monkey, which is a utility application and an updater program. And you're also going to be installing the drivers for uh, your device as well. So all of that's installed. One thing that I do want to point out is that uh, you may uh, want to check our website for updated software. We offer new releases of Podform, Podfarm excuse me, per periodically. Um, and you can check our website to make sure that you have the latest version, or you can launch Line 6 Monkey. Line 6 Monkey will also tell you if you need an updated version. But if you want to go to our website, you can go to www.line6.com forward slash software, and that's where you find all of our uh, latest versions of uh, software. So uh, what we're going to do now is we're going to register the product. Um, if, if this is your first time taking the Pod Studio out of the box, uh, what we're going to do first is launch Line 6 Monkey. And I've got Line 6 Mon Monkey saved down here, uh, this little shortcut down in our, my tool tray here. Uh, it also lives in uh, the Applications folder. Oh, So if you click on your hard drive icon and go to Applications and the locate the Line 6 folder, it's in there along with PodFarm. So let's just launch it from the, from the shortcut. Okay, so the first message we see is, uh, hey, you need to register your product. Um, and that's what Monkey's telling us. And we're going to go ahead and do what the Monkey tells us to. So let's click on register. And what should happen now is Monkey should open a browser for you uh, if you're connected to the Internet. And you should be connected to the Internet. Um, and that's exactly what it did. It opened up Firefox. And it actually took, uh, took me right into my user account uh, registered, uh, registered gear section under my account here. If you haven't created a Line6.com user account, you can do that by going to Line6.com and cl uh, clicking on uh, New Account. You'll see that up here. Um, I also have another video tutorial on how to do that. So we're assuming that you have a user account created. Um, so let's go down and register this product. Cool thing about Monkey is it has the product pre-selected for us, and it's uh, inputted our serial number. So all we have to do is put the date of purchase in, and let's just uh, uh, select today as a data pur purchase and then click on register gear. Okay, at the bottom of the list you'll see Pod Studio UX2. You'll see the serial number, the date of purchase, and a remove link. If you ever wanted to remove the, the registration, you can do that as well. Alright, so we are registered. So let's go ahead and close out of our web browser. Let's click OK here in Monkey. And uh, what, what I'm going to do is just close out of Line 6 Monkey and relaunch it to just sort of refresh it so it'll know that we registered. Okay. Monkey's giving us a different, <coughs> a different message now. It's saying, um, hey, your uh, hardware hasn't been uh, activated to allow uh, some of the features that you purchased along with the Pod Studio to work, and that's the PodFarm plugin and the Effects Junkie model pack. So let's go ahead and do that. Let's click OK. Again, uh, we have to have an internet connection for this. Uh, it won't work without an internet connection. So uh, instead of register now in Monkey, you see activate features. So let's go ahead and click on activate features so we can activate our PodFarm plugin and our FX Junkie model pack. Um, so what's happening right now is Monkey is uh, sending some information over to our server here at Line 6. Uh, line 6 server is going to validate that it's, uh, that it's a, a legitimate device. It's going to... Uh, give it the thumbs up and send back uh, the uh, the factory features that uh, that come with the device. And again, th that's the PodFarm plugin and the Effects Junkie Pack. One thing to note, one thing to note here is we're in the optional add-ons tab in Line 6 Monkey, and you'll see that right here there's these little circles with these little dashes in, inside, and uh, nothing is, uh, is checked off. Uh, so our PodFarm plugin right here is has not been activated, and nor has our effects junkie. Um, so what we should see after uh, this is finished programming the hardware is, uh, is, a, is a green check mark. Um, and let's see if this works. It should.
Okay, so the message here is unplug the UX2 for five seconds and then plug it back in. So we're going to go ahead and do that. Okay, so so far so good. Uh, Monkey says that we're, gu we're good to go. Let's click OK. And there you go. Uh, we've got our green circle with our white check mark for effects junkie. And we've got our green circle with a white check mark for pod farm. And it's as simple as that. Um, <coughs> we're registered. Our device has been activated. Our factory features have been activated. Everything's good. Um, so uh, that's basically it.